Hey everybody, thanks for joining me. In today's video, we're going to be painting this coyote. So if you wanna stick around and watch, we'll just jump right in. Now I just gotta put a little bit of an acrylic underpainting, just marking out the areas that the uh, coyote will be. And uh, we'll be taking off here before too long with some paint. doing a wash it's just a little bit of paint a whole lot of paint thinner going down and then I'm just lightly wiping out some of the areas of the lightest values and doing another wash of the warm yellow ochre now here I'm mixing up a load of snow paint <laughs> I need to go ahead and mix as much as I can and have all the colors so we'll be ready I don't want to have to keep remixing it because it's very hard to get the colors exactly right so you mix a lot Now I'm just laying in the background of, this is the actual paint, oil paint going in, and it's just a very interesting purplish gray, and this is basically my snow. That's all it is to it. Um, now I'm putting in a lot of the, um, just the blocking in stage of the coyote, and I'm putting down, um, there's no detail going in, it's just values here and there, um, keeping it simple at first. As you can see, we're starting to get some detail in. And I'm still working on the lighter, warmer values in the front of the, the coyote where the sun's hitting. And so I'm working on the little tufts of hair and, and uh, of course, painting light values on top of dark values helps create that volume of the fur. <laughs>
Now I'm putting in, a, oh, you're going to see that I have put in some of the detail in the snow. And you'll see that there are actually some uh, rabbit tracks. I have this uh, coyote in hot pursuit of a rabbit. Perhaps it's the one that got away. I don't know. But I am laying in a lot of the lighter values where the sun is hitting the front of his fur and warming him up. And that's why this is such a fun painting for me because I love playing with the warm colors of the coyote's fur against the actual cold snow. And here's probably one of my favorite brushes. This is a uh, Rosemary Rigger. It's a very fine point and it's great for making fine detail and lots of little tufts. And you can see I'm just putting in a little bit of light paint here and there. And of course the lighter values are always the last ones I generally put in. Here you see there's more detail in the snow going in and you know that I'm getting close to the end of this painting if I'm working this far into the foreground and uh, there you have it. I think this looks pretty darn good. And uh, you know there's the detail work on the coyote. I like how the light catches his back. It's a little bit warmer on the very top of his back. He says he's even kicking up a little snow there. But yeah, not a bad little piece. Well, I hope you enjoyed uh, painting the coyote along with me today. I, uh, I, I dug it. I really did dig it. It was, um, it was doing the that warm, lush fur against the cool colors of the snow. Just are, there's just something about playing cools and warms off of each other that's so exciting. So 
I enjoyed that process. Again, I hope that you enjoyed today's video and that if you enjoyed it so much, you'd wanna be a subscriber, go ahead and smack that button and uh, subscribe. Give me some thumbs up too if you like the video and if you have any questions at all about anything you saw today or perhaps you have an idea of something you either wanna see me paint or a product review or something like that, go ahead and uh, leave it in the comments and I'll get back to you, okay? And again, thank you so much and I'll see you next time. Bye.